elephant toothpaste. So I'm gonna first, um, you need hydrogen peroxide, uh, about 100 milliliters of it, and you're gonna need yeast, warm water, spoon, food coloring, it, optional, dish soap, funnel, a, what is it, a pan, and a plastic water bottle. So I'm going to be using a funnel. I'm going to put the hydrogen peroxide inside. Into a bottle. Now I'm going to be putting the dish soap. Squint a little bit dish soap. Now let's put the food coloring. Oh. Okay, and then after that you're going to need yeast and warm water. Take a teaspoon and put four table uh, tablespoons of of warm water. Now mix it. So uh, so I'm done mixing the yeast and water. We're gonna put the yeast right here. Here. Three, one, two, three. two. Wait. Oh, yeah, it's... Oh, no. Back off, back off. Wow. It's really hot when you touch the bottle. Really foamy liquid. And it looks like lava is spinning out. So, the yeast practically decomposed our hydrogen peroxide. The chemical formula for hydrogen peroxide is H2O2. What happened is the yeast decomposed it. The yeast decomposed the hydrogen peroxide into H2O plus O. And what happened is the dish soap, it mixed with the oxygen. Hence, it turned into the foamy substance that we're seeing right now. As I'm feeling the so foamy substance as of now, uh, it's actually pretty warm. And the reason why is because this is having an exothermic reaction. According to the name itself, exo means out and thermic means heat.